would you? Hey, Haley. It's Joyce. Okay, Haley. Oh, hey, Hale. Joyce, didn't see you there. Yeah. How's it going, Kenny? Pretty good, pretty good. You? Good. That's good. So, what are you wearing to the costume party Saturday? Oh, nothing interesting. Probably just like a ghost costume or something. What about you? Oh, well, you see, I was thinking that maybe, you know, we could do something together. Like, costume-wise, just because just cause Kyle and Sean are going as the plug in the outlet. Joel and Josie are going as drunken Irishmen. And Dayton and Sasha are going as Romeo and Juliet after they died. I was thinking it'd be cool if we went together. We could be like Zelda and Link. Or Einstein and Mileva. Or actually I was thinking Edward Cullen and Bella Swan, you know, from those books. We could like act out a scene or something together. I could just imagine. <laughs> Why don't you like me? I do like you. I can't get enough of you. Your smell, it intoxicates me. It's like my own personal brand of heroin that I can't get a hold of. It's like... It's like... It's like pumping sugar into your blood every 482 hours of the day. It's like yanking the stem of a pumpkin and using it to draw a lightning bolt on your chest. It's like riding a skeleton horse into the depths of hell with a demon on your back. And it's like whiskey at seven in the morning. It's like snorting prescription drugs on a Ferris wheel. It's like digesting a rattlesnake that just ate a cactus. It's like massaging your back with a cheese grater. But wait, I have more. It's like falling into a meat grinder and living to tell the tale. It's like sticking a stake through the head of, insert your enemy's name here. It's like chewing a wad of gum the size of rotting cabbage. It's like tur cutting your arm off with a globe. It's like Elmo at Christmas time. It's like a clock striking 13. It's like throwing yourself a funeral. It's like looking at a painting of a cottage. It's like eating your rug. It's like planting shrubs. It's like all of the world's epicness united. Where was I going with this? <sighs> Why can't you love me? Just like I've always imagined. <laughs> oh, yeah, about that. Um, I just forgot. My mom, she's getting surgery on her head on Saturday night during the time of the party. So she really wants everybody there for moral support. Um, I'm going to have to decline your wonderful offer. Sorry. Okay. I completely understand. Your mother is more important. So I wish her the best of luck. From Kenny. <laughs> Thank God. Oh, hey, Haley. It's Joyce. <gasps> oh, Dean, you're creative. You probably have an idea for the costume party. I'm going as a computer, a computer on Facebook specifically. I'm going to talk all night about the harmful effects and addiction of Facebook. All the ways it controls your life. And oh, it won't release you from its traps. <laughs> yep, that's my costume. I'm going to change the world for sure. Wow, neat. How'd you come up with that one? Well, you see, last Saturday night, I was in the middle of breathing in my harmful yet beautiful addiction, Facebook. That's it until my computer started talking to me. Take that, you mongrel. This is so fun. Stop poking me, you stupid! I'll just poke you back! Poke, 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 poke. I'm the poking master! <laughs> we need to have a talk. In what the? Where is that coming from? I think we need to have a talk. In Computer? Yeah. <gasps> this is sweet! Hello, Facebook member. Look at your wall. Now back to mine. Now look at your wall. Now back to mine. 
Sadly, it isn't mine. But if you get off Facebook and do something with your life, it could look like it's mine. Look down. Back up. Where are you? You're at a party with thousands of hot girls with walls like mine. Look at your screen. The party is now a concert with people who actually live and talk to others outside of the computer. Anything is possible when you get outside and do something in your life. I'm in a tree. I'm in a tree. It sounds weird, but that's what happened exactly. It's this time from the herd gods, telling me they're mad for my bitch riddle to Facebook. I'm a dirty bugger, but I, I survived my horrendous addiction. And now I must tell everyone my story and show people all the bad effects of Facebook. They're addicted like I was. I must help them, even if they can't handle it. Well, good luck with that. It's a sign from the god! I tell you, a sign! My coworkers cannot get any weirder. Oh goody, they officially have. Haley, I hear you're asking everyone what they're being for the costume party. It's Joyce. Wait, you're talking to me? You're talking to me! I mean, wow, this is weird. But, oh yeah, I am. Um, just curious, I guess. Well. Well what? Aren't you going to ask me? Oh, sorry! <laughs> um, yeah, so what are you being for the costume party, Sarah? I'm not. You're not? Yeah, not. But why not? Because it's against my beliefs. But it'll be fun! <laughs> my belief doesn't allow me to have fun in the outside world. Well, that's... awful. What are you going to do instead? Well, you see, I'm going to watch The Wrong and the Senseless. The Wrong and the... Senseless. Well, you see, in the last episode... <laughs>